Happy Camp NaNoWriMo day one, friends. It is April 1st. <sighs> I'm not in the Camp Nano brain set at all, mindset, but I'm gonna try because I've got words to do and I've got 15 days to finish this project. I am 10K away from finishing this ghostwriting project. I would like to finish it way before the 15th so I can do a full read through of it um tweak anything that needs tweaking and then officially sent it in so that is the plan but first i am going to stream on twitch it is saturday i stream 2 p.m eastern over on twitch on saturdays i take sundays and mondays off so let's get some stuff done Monday. It is Monday, April 10th. And yeah, I feel like I haven't spoken to you guys in quite some time. Hi. <laughs> Good to see you. Cheers. So I apologize because last week there was not a video. Life caught up with me big time and I needed the break. Um, I just couldn't concoct what was necessary to make it for that Wednesday. So we are back this week and we're talking about Q2, quarter two goals. We are officially in Q2 now and it's already almost two weeks into it. And so what is it that I have planned? What is it that I need to get done for the next three months? There is a list friends, there is a list so I'm going to share with you my quarter two goals. So I hope you guys are having a fantastic entrance into the quarter two era of this new year. That is not so new anymore. We're already four months into it. How the hell? Seriously. So we got a few things to discuss. Let's get into it. What is quarter two goal number one? Number one goal for quarter two is to finish drafting and turning in the ghostwriting project to my client. As some of you know, I've been working on a ghostwriting project that I picked up back in January, officially, at the end of January, I believe it was. And so from there, I brainstormed with the client what it is they wanted for the story, and then I started drafting it. I had a month and some, a month and two weeks. So I was given plenty, was it a month and two weeks? So it couldn't have been January, it must have been February. I think February was when I took on the client because I only had like uh, six weeks to turn in a 50K manuscript that they wanted of their story. So the due date is April 15th and I am officially done with drafting the manuscript. So check, that got done. Uh, what I'm currently doing is now proofreading the entire manuscript, making any little tweaks and edits I find before officially turning it in five days from now. So, or four days at this point, because today, yeah. Anyway, so that is the number one goal for this second quarter is to actually finish drafting the manuscript, which I did, proofread it and turn it into the client. So I am almost done with completing that quarter two goal number one. Quarter two goal number two is editing project blinding lights. Because of the ghostwriting project, I had to put blinding lights on the side momentarily so I could focus on drafting these 50K words. But now that I'm finished, I have slowly started going back to reread the last portion of the manuscript that I have, which is my first draft that I printed out. Many of you have seen it. If you haven't, here it is. There is a major typo on it. Let's ignore that. I'm trying to every time now that I was brought uh, awareness into it. But anyways, this is a proof copy of my first draft of Project Blinding Lights. And she's a chunky one. Yes, I know. And I am 
pretty much almost through with the full reread of this. And in the meantime, I've started incorporating small little edits that I have already made from the book to the manuscript because I'm going to have a critique partner start reading it soon. So I'm very excited because things are moving forward. I can't forget this project. This project is one that I hope to traditionally publish. So I need to get it ready for queering agents later this year. So that is the goal for quarter two is to finish the full editing process of Project Blinding Lights. So that is what I plan to do. I am going to first do self edits, going to then listen to some critique partners and then potentially send it to beta readers and then maybe an editor. We shall see friends. I gotta, I gotta see. I'm trying to make this as pretty as possible because I want it to have its best chance to get picked up by a literary agent and ultimately a publishing house. So we shall wait and see. Second quarter goal number three. This one's going to be hard to talk about because I can't really say a lot about it. But goal, goal number three is about a secret project. Now, I'm so sorry to be that type of person who's going to be like, this is a secret project, but I can't tell you. It's I'm so excited, friends. I It's going to be it's a big deal. This secret project is going to be an investment into my future. This secret project is going to be a creative release. This secret project is going to open up opportunities that maybe I didn't even see possible or coming. I am really excited. What I can say is that it's it involves me and one other person and we are working towards something. That is all I can say, I'm so sorry. But I am really, really excited. And this is going to take a huge chunk of my second quarter. Um, there is a lot of preliminary work that needs to get done. And that is definitely going to be scheduled throughout the next three months. So I will be working heavily on that project alongside editing my book, which means I may not be taking on another ghostwriting client just yet. So originally I was going to finish ghostwriting uh, this current project and immediately jump into a potential another one that I had in the works. Um, but I that was never guaranteed and I did not feel fully confident about that opportunity. And if that wasn't gonna come through, I was gonna go back on Upwork and get a new one and just go back to the process of sending out proposals for a new ghostwriting project. I don't believe I'm going to be doing that just yet because there is so much work that needs to be done with the secret project alongside keeping up with YouTube, alongside family stuff, alongside Project Blinding Lights, alongside Twitch, alongside Day Job. There's, there's a lot going on. So... I am potentially putting the next ghostwriting opportunity on hold to work this quarter on building something that I believe could potentially be an investment for my future. And trust me, as soon as I'm able to say anything, you guys will be the second to know because the first to know would be my newsletter friends. So if you haven't signed up for my newsletter, I release it the third Wednesday of every month. You get exclusive content and first dibs on any exciting news. You can sign up for that in the link down below. So my newsletter folks would be the very first people to find out about it. And you guys would definitely be a very close second to finding out any information that I can release when the time comes. Quarter two goal number four is Stegen Society publication promotional stuff. So Stegen Society is publishing my short story in their anthology collection, which I will be making an official video with all the details very soon. I am so behind on that but I just have had life happen. So 
I am working on making sure to get that video out with all the details about the Kickstarter and everything. But since I'm getting my uh, short story published, it is going to come out within the end of this quarter. So the end of this quarter, we will be getting opportunity to purchase a collection of short stories and one of mine will be in the collection which is still surreal and very exciting and again i will go more into that in the official video where i make the full announcement with details but there is going to be some promotional stuff that needs to take place and events so i'm making sure to put those things into my calendar in preparation for the promotional and marketing of this book quarter to goal number five i need to save for my best friend's wedding my best friend heather is getting married august 20th of this year and i will be flying over to her in seattle for the wedding i am part of the wedding party which is really exciting and i feel super honored and um yeah i need to save up for that i uh, need to make saving a big goal for this quarter because august will be here before i know it and i need to make preparations before august i need to buy the dress before august i need to book the planes the, the plane ticket and the stay before august there's a lot of things that need to happen and i absolutely need to focus on saving and making that happen this quarter somehow so that's <clears throat> so that's a biggie that i have in the forefront of my mind and i need to definitely make a priority as well in addition to that i need to save for editing i need to save for editing project blinding lights i kind of have a dual time frame of oh boy yeah so not only am I saving for my best friend's wedding, but for the same time frame, I'm saving for editing Project Blinding Lights. Holy crap. So, this may be why I do need to take on another ghostwriting project um, in the midst of everything. I'm trying not to overwhelm myself. Um, but the reality is, is I have some big stuff coming at the end of summer and I need to prepare for them. And financially, that is going to be tough. So I have a lot of saving and plans I need to strategically get going. I need to save up for a lot of things. So I may need to take on another ghostwriting client. I'll keep you guys updated on what happens with all that. But that is the other quarter to goal. And last but not least, I think it's number six, I lost count, is to save for the secret project. There is a lot of saving going on and holy crap, I'm not overwhelmed. <laughs> Time is flying and there is a lot that financially is needed. So, so let's recap. Quarter two goals, number one, is to finish and turn in the ghostwriting project to the client. We're very close to making that happen. Awesome sauce. Quarter goal two, goal, no. Quarter two goal number two is editing project blinding lights. That is definitely a goal to have done. First, starting with self edits, critique partners and beta reader edits, and then we'll see where we go from there. Quarter goal number three is the secret project. So working on all the elements that are involved in this secret project with someone else and making these investments for a future date. Quarter goal number four is the Stegen Society publication and all the promotional dates and activities that are to come before release, which will happen at the end of this quarter. Goal number five, save for my best friend's wedding. Goal number six, save for editing project lights and goal number seven save for secret project funds and that folks is the conclusion of my quarter two goals holy crap there's a lot to figure out and that doesn't include life in between it all so i most definitely need to very much adopt time management 
within this quarter because there is so much going on and I absolutely want and desire to see all these things come to pass and they're important to me. So I really need to make out the time each and every day for each of these goals in addition to all the other things I have going on in life. And that is it friends. Those are the goals for my quarter two that I aim to accomplish by the end of June. How are you guys doing so far with April? I know a lot of you are doing Camp NaNoWriMo. I hope you guys are doing really well with your word counts. I am not participating in Camp Nano this year. I am streaming since I do have to write words and I am around to help the community and encourage the community to come together, which is what I love about Nano. What I love about NaNoWriMo in November, what I love about the Camp Nanos, April and July is it? And yeah, or April and June, one of those two. But I love when the community comes together and we encourage each other in our writing, in our creativity. We don't feel alone. We have people to commiserate with. It's, it's, it's really wonderful that we can get together in these ways more than once a year. And then it encourages new friendships within the writing community that you can have all year round. So I will not be participating in Camp Nano, but I am streaming over on Twitch Tuesday through Saturday. Um, Tuesday through Friday, 1 p.m. Eastern. Saturdays, 2 p.m. Eastern. And I take Sundays and Mondays off, but I still stream here on YouTube Mondays 8 p.m. right by the moon live streams. So there is plenty of opportunities to get together and write. What are your quarter two goals, friends? Let me know in the comments below. Give me a little snip, snippet of what you guys hope to accomplish for the next three months. And let's encourage each other and keep each other accountable. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe so you don't miss out on next week's video. I have a newsletter you can sign up for down below. I have a merch shop that is on Redbubble with plenty of designs that you can check out and place on a plethora of merchandise. Thank you guys so much again for watching. Thank you for all the well wishes for my family. I appreciate each and every one of you and I will see you all very soon.